Welcome to Zen Mind Studio, a convergence of philosophical wisdom and the art of mental well-being. Today we will talk about purpose in our life, and is it something we should find at one moment, or is it day-to-day -day meaning of our lives? Oh, the grand quest for purpose in life. It's the ultimate existential treasure hunt, isn't it? The kind of journey that makes Indiana Jones' adventures look like a walk in the park. We're all out here trying to crack the Da Vinci code of our existence, except instead of ancient cryptic messages, we're deciphering the signs from the universe, motivational quotes, and maybe even a fortune cookie or two. Let's start with the classic purpose question. What in the world are we here for? Some say it's about making a difference, leaving a legacy, or simply finding joy and fulfillment. But, let's be real, sometimes it feels like we're playing a cosmic game of hide-and-seek, and purpose is the trickster hiding in the most unexpected places. It's like trying to find your keys in the dark, plenty of fumbling and frustration before you finally stumble upon it. Now let's talk about the pressure. The pressure to find our calling can be heavier than a sumo wrestler sitting on a suitcase. We're bombarded with stories of people who have found their life's purpose and are out there changing the world, making us feel like we're just shuffling through life while they're out there running marathons. But hey, let's not forget that the pressure to find our purpose can sometimes be as useful as a screen door on a submarine. It's also important to acknowledge that the pursuit of purpose can feel like navigating a maze blindfolded. We're often handed a map with vague pointers like follow your passion and make a difference, but nobody bothers to mention that the passion might be as elusive as a unicorn in Central Park, and making a difference could feel as overwhelming as trying to clean the ocean with a teaspoon. Now, Here's the kicker. Why does purpose always feel like a secret recipe with a sprinkle of unicorn dust and a dash of serendipity? It's like trying to decode an ancient language, only this time, it's the language of the soul. And oh boy, the soul loves to speak in riddles and metaphors. Let's not forget the impact part. It's not just about finding your purpose, it's about making an impact with it. After all, having a purpose without making an impact is like having a cake without the frosting. It's just not the same. The impact is the validation, the aha moment that justifies the whole purpose quest. It's the part where you get to put a big, bold check mark next to changing the world. But here's the million dollar question. Can we really make an impact without losing ourselves in the process? It's like trying to juggle flaming torches while riding a unicycle, a delicate balance that requires ninja level skill and a whole lot of faith in yourself. All right, let's talk about the journey. Finding your purpose is like trying to build a ship while navigating the stormy seas. It's equal parts trial and error, a splash of courage, and a whole lot of resilience. The journey is rarely a straight path. It's more like a roller coaster with unexpected loops and sharp turns. And let's not forget the occasional, are we there yet? Moments that make us want to throw our metaphorical hands in the air and scream. At the end of the day, finding your purpose is as much about the journey as it is about the destination. It's the stories you collect along the way, the scars that turn into badges of honor, and the moments of clarity that feel like finding an oasis in the desert. It's about embracing the messiness of the quest, celebrating the detours and dead ends, and realizing that sometimes the purpose isn't a grand, earth-shattering revelation. Sometimes, it's just a quiet whisper, a gentle nudge in the right direction, and a promise that you're exactly where you need to be. 
So, my fellow purpose seekers, here's to embracing the chaos, the uncertainty, and the occasional existential crisis. After all, the quest for purpose is like a game of cosmic charades. Sometimes you've got to act out a whole lot of nonsense before you finally hit the jackpot. Cheers to the glorious mess that is the pursuit of purpose. As for the end, we will leave you with an amazing quote from one great Stoic Marcus Aurelius. Never let the future disturb you. You will meet it, if you have to, with the same weapons of reason which today arm you against the present. Thank you for joining us on this journey of inner growth and well-being. If you found this video insightful and uplifting, be sure to subscribe, like and share this video. Together, let's continue to cultivate a space of inner tranquility and wisdom.